Here's one involving two cars traveling the same direction, leaving at the same time. So let's see, we have two cars leave Savannah, Georgia at the same time, and both travel north on Interstate 95. The first car's speed is 40 miles per hour, and the second car's speed is 50 miles per hour. When will the cars be 20 miles apart? Okay, so as soon as I see miles per hour, I know it's going to be rate times time equals distance, which means that we need to use our table. There it is. Okay. Let's fill in the pieces here. We have two cars, a 40 mile per hour car and a 50 mile per hour car. So I'm just going to say, let's do the slow car and the fast car. All right. The slow car goes 40 miles per hour. The fast car goes 50 miles per hour. Okay, now the problem says when. When will the cars be 20 miles apart? So that tells me that T is the unknown. Okay, usually when they ask, when the, when the word problem ends with when is, da, 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 or something like that, that means that t is going to be your variable. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in, t and t. And then this is rate times time equals distance. So 40 times t, 40 t. 50 times t, 50 t. OK, but this problem is unique because they're both traveling in the same direction. And it's asking when the cars will be 20 miles apart. Um, so what that means is we take the fast car distance, subtract off the slow car distance. Maybe we can draw a little picture here. All right, so here, here, here here's, uh, let's see, let's just do like a starting point here. Okay, so the fast car has gone to here. Okay, so there's our fast car. Our slow car has gotten to here, and this distance between them is what, this is what the problem is saying, is 20 miles. Okay, so to, to find that, we can just take the fat, the total distance that the fast car has gone, and subtract off the distance that the slow, so here's the fast distance, here's the slow distance, Right, and if we subtract fast minus slow, that will give us the distance between them. Minus slow. Okay, so that's how we, when we talk about how far things are apart, that in this context at least means that we're subtracting the distances. So we're going to subtract the fast distance minus the slow distance. Okay, so we have 50t minus 40t, and the distance we're looking for is 20 miles, per, uh, 20 miles, so 20 miles. And when we solve for t, that will tell us how long until the cars are 20 miles apart. All right, 50t minus 40t is 10t equals 20, so t must be two hours. There we go. When will the cars be 20 miles apart? Well, after two hours. Again, check the answer to make sure that it's reasonable, right? If we got 2,000 hours or 0 0.09 hours, something like that, I don't know, 0 0.005 hours, something might be weird. We might want to go back and check it. Two hours seems about what we'd expect for this kind of problem.